Introducing Masumi's new button die extracting tools. Masumi developed this new set of tools to eliminate the need to disassemble die components because of how labor intensive it is. Previously, round button dies couldn't be replaced directly on the die, which could lead to long downtimes. But with Masumi's button die extracting tools, the process is now streamlined. The button dies can be pulled out from the front of the die plate and there's no need to remove inserts or reverse the die. An added benefit to this set is that your toolmakers don't require any experience and only need minimal training to utilize this tool as needed, saving you time and money. As you can see in the time lapse, the toolmaker on the left has no experience in die maintenance, but was successful in replacing the button die and completed it faster than the toolmaker on the right with experience using the conventional way. To show you how easy it is, follow the step-by-step -step process. Step 1. Measure the inner diameter of the button die. Step 2. Choose the puller which applies to the inner diameter size. In this example, we will use the puller range of 8.0 to 8.9 millimeters. Pullers may be damaged if they are used outside of applicable dimensions. Step 3. Loosen the nut of the puller, then insert into the button die. Tighten the nut of the puller, then confirm the retention from the step of the internal diameter of the button die. Step 4. Using the wrench, hand tighten the nut with two to three turns. Step 5. Attach the joint nut to the puller. Thread the joint nut until it's flush with the button die surface. Step 6. Attach the extractor to the hammer. Slide the hammer a few times to make sure the puller is attached properly. Step 7. Continue to slide the hammer until the button die is extracted. Step 8. And now you can remove the button die from the puller. The button die extraction is now complete. Streamline your process today with Masumi's new button die extracting tools. Visit masumi.info forward slash button die.